The Forbidden City is a palace complex located in Beijing's Dongcheng district. In the Imperial City of Beijing, the Forbidden City, also known as the Imperial Palace of the Ming and Qing dynasties in Beijing, was built between 1406 and 1420 by Ming Emperor Zhu Di and witnessed the enthronement of 14 Ming and 10 Qing emperors over the next 505 years. The English name, Forbidden City, comes from the Chinese word, Zijum Cheng, which means, Forbidden City, referring to the fact that no one could enter or leave the walled city or Cheng without the Emperor's permission. The Emperor's mansion was built facing north as an earthly counterpart to the Celestial Purple Palace, i.e. the North Star, albeit it was to be the Celestial Emperor's residence. The Ban City was named from the fact that it was considered a divine location that was strictly forbidden to regular people. For over 500 years, the Forbidden City served as China's political and religious center. Despite the fact that it is no longer an imperial precinct, it remains one of China's most important cultural heritage sites and the most visited museum with an average of 80,000 visitors every day. The Forbidden City is the largest imperial palace in the world. The Forbidden City is 720,000 square meters in size, more than three times the size of France's Louvre Palace. It contains about 90 palace quarters and courtyards, as well as 980 buildings and 8,728 rooms. The Forbidden City is claimed to have a total of 9,999 and a half rooms because only the God of Heaven has the right to 10,000 rooms. Emperor Chengzu, who built the Forbidden City, named himself the Son of the God of Heaven, indicating that his palace would be smaller. It is now the Palace Museum, which houses hundreds of ancient Chinese antiques and works of art. Over the course of approximately 500 years, the palace was home to 24 successive Chinese emperors. The Forbidden City still stands at Beijing's physical and symbolic center after six centuries of fires, battles, and political struggles. When American writer David Kidd arrived in Beijing in 1981 after a three-decade absence, he found the city to be practically unrecognizable. The beams and columns of the Forbidden City are built of wood, as are the walls that divide the halls into different rooms. In classical Chinese architecture, wood was the preferred material. The Forbidden City is home to the world's most well-preserved medieval wooden constructions. According to Guinness World Records, the Forbidden City is home to the world's largest palace. Bruni's Istana Naruli Man is known as the world's largest residential palace. The Forbidden City, as China's only living and best example of an imperial palace, is a representative of China's ancient official architecture, demonstrating ultimate techniques and artistry in construction. It is a historical architectural gem in China. Hope you have enjoyed watching the video. Do like and subscribe. Keep watching all our videos.